Hello LGs, this is the lady. I'm coming in to show you guys another unit that I have and it is a glueless cap wig. It is a new designed glueless cap wig. For those of you who who did not like the glueless cap wig that had the pull string in the back, then maybe you will like this one because it does not have the pull string, okay? And also, the original glueless cow wig that I did a review on for you guys um, had the thicker lace around the perimeter of your face so that when you pulled on the pull string or the straps in the back, it will pull that lace down and make it lay flush to your face and that kept it from lifting so you could wear your hair back stuff without worrying about your hair the uh, lace of the unit lifting on the sides or anything so let's get started I'm gonna show you what's the difference on this particular glueless cap wig it has Swiss lace in the front so this piece right here that you're going to cut off is Swiss lace as well as all of this right here in the front of the unit. From here all the way into the center is your Swiss lace. Swiss lace is very thin and it's going to show up everything. Whatever whatever you have underneath is going to be seen through that Swiss lace. And then of course in the back is just your regular stretch cap. So this does act as a full lace wig but it's glueless. That means that you can part this wig anywhere anywhere and you'll get the full lace effect. Let me show you what um, you part the hair in this area where that that lace cloth is And this is how it looks. Okay, so because I don't have on a stocking cap and I'm just using my own scalp, you see this? This hair is so silky soft. It's almost slick, you know, so that's that really. So hopefully, you guys can see it. Just show you guys with my foam head here since it's white and it'll see through a lot better. Okay, so right in here is the hairline of this unit and I really am loving the hairline. This is from the same manufacturer that did the Italian Yaki for me and their hairline is just like, oh my goodness, I love it. Look how natural and pretty that is. It is just so so beautiful. It's not that real thick hairline. You know how some of these wigs, most of them actually have just this real uh, you know, this 100% density or 120% density right in the forehead area and you're going to have to go in and tweezer out some of the hair and all of that trying to make it look more natural not with this particular uh, this particular manufacturer they actually make the density of their units real nice and natural looking so that's one of the things that I really really like about these two units that I'm showing you and yeah but it's beautiful this is a color number two so hopefully you guys can see a little bit of the brown in it. It may be showing just black, but I'm going to try it on for you. What I just I, what I want to do on this mannequin head is just show you. I'm going to go ahead and part it so you can see that no matter where you part it, you're going to see skin. Okay? So you see that? And you're seeing skin again. There you go. 
and then this piece in the back here it looks more like a it's a little bit darker as you can see it's a little bit darker right in here because it has uh, a different kind of lace material so that is all the way to the back so that's how that looks alright so now I'm going to go and show you the inside of the cap before I try it on so again I've already shown you the Swiss lace in the front on the side it does not have any of the Swiss lace but it does have this little fabric here and this piece has a bendable little metal piece in here that you can bend so that it lays down flat to your um, ear tab and that keeps the ear tabs down so that you don't have to apply it with glue or tape or bob bobby pins or install any wig clips or anything like that so that's what is on the sides as well as in the back this piece is in the back as well so I'm going to show you turn it around and show you that piece in the back and it's like a uh, flap in the back that lays flush to your nape so you can wear this glueless cap wig in an updo okay and you don't have to worry about the straps being seen so this is this is the adjustable straps in the back with that flap right there and that's why the um, the color is a little different than what you see on the lace alright so I'm gonna now go ahead and put on this unit I just come from getting my massage I go once a month and um, I went just like this with my no hair and with without any of my wigs on of course I had a, a cap on because of, it was a little cool outside but when I got in to get my massage of course I took my hat off and um, I'm pretty sure the guy who was giving me my massage went where happened to that lady that was <laughs> I got a man on my table now <laughs> But because uh, I had to take off my earrings as well, so uh, <laughs> I, I'll probably look like Fester sitting <laughs> laying up on the uh, on the table. But anyway, um, he gave me a oh my gosh, okay, he gave me a wonderful, wonderful massage. It was awesome. Um, I don't know what it is, but whenever I went to get my hair done, when I had hair, of course, um, I, I just think. The best stylists I've ever had were guys. And I never had to really, you know, tell them the kind of style that I wanted. I would normally just sit in their seat and they will, you know, whoop up a style for me that fit my face or my personality or whatever. And I loved it. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's maybe I just prefer the the men to do me do my hair and or whatever but I said all that to say this is the first time I've ever had a guy to give me a massage it was always the women would give me my massage but so I was a little bit apprehensive about you know getting undressed and 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 on the table with this guy giving me my massage but he was wonderful I mean oh my gosh it was it was wonderful he used those elbows and just went really deep and um, I, I <laughs> that didn't come out right he went deep massage a, a deep tissue massage is what he gave me and it was like oh my goodness it was wonderful so of course I'm going back to him to get my my next one next month but um, he was awesome but anyway he he uh, when he came in and uh, when he started doing my neck mas my my neck uh, to, to my massage he went all the way up you know the back of my head and and then he started uh, massaging my head and he said oh you have such a nice head <laughs> he said he liked my bald head and uh, he told me to make sure I told tell you guys that 
there are men out there who love women with bald heads okay so don't be ashamed of your bald head ladies rock it and be proud of it <laughs> but as I put this wig on let me go ahead and uh, show you guys what this unit looks like so of course you can see I haven't cut the lace off of it and this lace goes from temple to temple and then you use these little bendable tabs on the side to lay down the sides okay just bend it to whatever fitting you need it and that's how that lays down all right so and I've already adjusted it in the back so that lace is laying down really nice and flat to my nape and this is the hair this silky straight so if you like really thin kind of um, strands of hair thin and silky 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 kind of um, texture this one right here is beautiful uh, loving the density around the hairline of course you can see these long wispy hairs and that's all the way around the unit but this hair is beautiful I mean I love the way it just it just flows Okay, that. And of course you can pull it back behind your ear without having to worry about your lace. You guys can see that. Okay. I like it. I'm going to stand up. I'm 5'6", close to 5'7". Let me just stand up so you guys can see how long it is. 20 inches. It's going to reach me in the middle of my back. So yeah, that is what I wanted to come in and show you guys really quick this unit. Um, what else do you guys need to know? How much it costs? Uh, for a 20 inch glueless cap wig, they run 265. So that's my preview on this particular unit. I'll talk to you guys later. You guys be blessed and a blessing. Uh, have a great weekend. Bye.